Hi, good morning. I was listening to the five dysfunctions of a team this morning and thinking, how can I be more supportive to my team as you all have been incredibly supportive of me and my heart is overflowing with gratitude. I literally was like crying to my mom this morning at how grateful I am for you guys. And as I was brainstorming this morning how can i help you with your goals i know some of you have goals for uh around health and weight loss and this morning i was reading my book the fitness professionals handbook i've got my work cut out for me um, i signed up for a nationally accredited personal training certification and which is exciting. Woohoo! Finally stepping into this big dream I've had for a long time and helping me serve. So, getting to the point of what I wanted to say is one of the best tools I could think of is, of course, water. <laughs> so, I, this is a 40 ounce container. I set it next to my bed at night. I drink water all throughout the day. And right when I wake up in the morning before I get out of bed, I start drinking water. I often feel very groggy. And most people go straight for the coffee to wake themselves up, which you're dumping a bunch of acid and all that stuff into your body. Hydrating your brain when you wake up. Your brain is over should be over 80% water, your organs, your lungs, your eyeballs, your liver. Our organs are in our body. We're made of mostly water <laughs> and other elements. So I try to drink two of these a day on a really good day. If I'm exercising or skiing or doing silks or something, I'll drink three of these and then I'm feeling really good. And, um, if I'm drinking a lot of coffee or other beverages, I struggle to get down two of these. So for my body weight, uh, the recommendation is um, a little over 80 ounces of water a day. So that's the minimum requirement, 20%, uh, 20%, 20%? <laughs> uh, of your body weight. It's like such a, now it's slipping my mind now that I'm like on camera. So anyways, um, I choose the Kangen water just because I feel that that works the best for me. Um, I have a harder time drinking 40 ounces of 40 to 80 to 120 ounces of tap water or bottled water or other waters, which I actually don't drink anymore. Um, and there's a reason for that. No, this is not to try to get anybody to get Kong in water. I just want to share the, this is my practice, my daily routine that serves me because it helps me hydrate my body on a cellular level. And the molecules are actually restructured. So they go into and penetrate the cell and flush out toxins and fat and things like that. So as I was brainstorming, like, how can I help? Um, my mom is doing the same thing right now. And it has been so exciting witnessing her journey. And I have a few friends who this has really been serving them in that area. So for me to keep it a secret and uh, know that this is a tool that could make like a powerful impact and really excel, uh, make those goals happen quicker. Um, for me not to say anything, I wouldn't be helping you guys. <laughs> so either way, um, filtered water, filter your water, because if you're gonna be drinking more water, um, there's chlorine and fluoride and all kinds of chemicals in the water, um, which, might be why it's hard to drink. So putting a filter, you know, any kind of filter, get a water test kit, test your water at home for chlorine. Um, you can even get like a pool kit, uh, the little pH drops and put them in your water and test for chlorine. Um, 
you want to be flushing that stuff out so you're not drinking it. And then in your shower too, I have this um, filter on the shower head. It's just a $40 filter I got at the co-op. Um, it's a good high quality filter. I'm not sure what it's called. I could look it up, but um, the chlorine in our waters, we're soaking it in, we're absorbing it in our skin, we're drinking it. So filtered water. Um, yeah, guys, water. That is one of the best tools for achieving optimum health and optimum brain function. So have a great day. Thank you so much. I love you guys. I hope this served you. And hasta the bye-bye. <laughs>